have been approved to start product developing my non-alcoholic wines finally by my investor. I've touched base with the distillery that I'm working with and everything's a go. All day I have been working on sourcing ingredients. And it's been a little bit more hectic than I thought. I may even have to push production back a day because things aren't lining up like I had planned. I was supposed to take a trip to pick up some of my ingredients a couple hours away and then drive them out to the North Fork, but I may just have to do that on Monday. I'm a bit stressed. Like the only, like my biggest, I don't stress out a lot, but the biggest stress, I guess that's the definition of stress. It's when things I can't control. You know, like when I, I want something to happen and it's not. And look at my nails. I think I just need to like, anyway. Mercury's also in retrograde, so I shouldn't be surprised that things aren't aligning, but <laughs> let's see what happens. It's like 3.30 and there is this winery I've always wanted to visit out in Maryland. And so I'm taking my parents to visit this winery with me and I wanna um, dive deeply um, more into their selection. So they have a little bit of a like live music tasting thing tonight. So I'm gonna head out there and it's also kind of work because I'm doing research, but I definitely have to be in New York on Sunday. My best friend and I and one of our other friends were going wedding dress shopping. And then Monday I'll for sure, hopefully be in the North Fork. For now, I'm gonna go enjoy myself with my parents at this live music tasting and hopefully get my mind off things because I've done everything that I can do. It's now just a waiting game to hear from other people. So let's go. Let's go on a road trip. Let's go. <laughs> Are you ready? Let's go. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> <laughs> go out the door. No, they can't. Yes. Okay, let's go. Okay. Morning. I'm quite exhausted, but Hitting the road this morning, I woke up at around 5 a.m. and I'm gonna run to Pennsylvania, pick up some ingredients that I need, and then head straight to the North Fork. Yeah, this is the start of it all, and I'm gonna try and get some energy. Yesterday I ran to New York, that's probably why I'm so tired. My best friend was wedding dress shopping, so I did a little day trip and I got back around maybe like seven or eight. I'm gonna finish packing and hit the road. The whole trip should take about eight hours and I'm running a little bit late. I wished I could have left maybe like half an hour ago, but I'm just going with the flow and going as fast as I can. <sighs> I'm so tired. I had no idea that this would be the last time I would be in Maryland for the next three months. That's a whole season. I missed all of spring because within the next week and a half, coronavirus would hit America and seriously affect my plans. <laughs> 